Hey guys. Hey guys. How you doing? ATM Ray here. Can I get you guys' name? My name's Staj. Can you, can you speak up a little bit? I'm so sorry. My name is Staj. Okay, yours? I'm June. Okay. Nice to meet y'all, man. Nice to meet you. Oh, I'm down to my last water, guys. I don't know if y'all want to split it or anything, but, you know, y'all don't got an interview with a dry mouth or nothing. Yeah. Split it like we do with everything. Like I usually do? Yeah. Okay. Hey. How old are y'all, man? How old are y'all? I'm 38. I'm okay. 32. 32? How long y'all been together? <laughs> a couple months. Not a couple, that long. A couple months? Time flies when you're in the haze. Yeah. Y'all engaged? No, no, but I will marry her. How y'all meet? Okay. Be in here. Met here in Kensington? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Any addictions y'all dealing with at the moment? <laughs> yep. Yep. I'm addicted to fentanyl, xylazine. Okay. And uh, whatever they cut it with, uh, Novocaine or whatever. Whatever they cut it with? Yeah. Yeah. So All you don't care what's in it? Cocaine. I don't care what's in it. They can put kerosene in this shit. Y'all got somewhere to lay your head at the moment? Yeah, the sidewalk. That you're the sidewalk? <laughs> I love it. Wow, man. It's, you know, it's traumatizing, guys. Where y'all from? Yeah, I'm from North. I'm from out here. You, know, you from Kensington, sir? Yeah, I mean, I used to live out here when I was younger. Okay. But yeah, I'm from all over Philly. I'm from Levittown. Uh, Levittown, PA? Levittown. Levittown. Where Levittown. that's at? Lower Bucks. Okay. All right. Yeah. Uh, she must have came. How much a day y'all spend on your habit? Everything. If I make a thousand dollars, I will shoot in our veins. Every penny. Every I'm, penny? I'm basically the doctor out here. I hit everybody. What you mean by the doctor? You shoot people up? Yeah, people that can't shoot up, I shoot them up and they pay me. Mm. That's his profession. Yeah. How do you make your money, man? Uh, he makes my money. He makes your money? Mm -hmm. That's right. You take care of your girl. Sir, here. I want to give my hat off to you, man. Take my hat off to you, sir. No, I'm, uh, I'm oh, going to give you your respect. I got you. Yeah, I got you. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Yeah, well, I hit people. Okay. They can't hit themselves. And All they right. me. Uh, <laughs> How many people you think you hit a day, man? You shoot up a day, sir? All day? Yeah. Uh, man. 50. Yeah, I was going to say, like 50 people come through there. 50 least. people a day? Yeah. That's a lot of money. Yeah. All right, guys, we just going to have to speak up. All right, it's loud. All we ain't going to cut it no more, all right? All right. Can y'all uh, break down y'all day-to-day -day basis out here? What y'all doing on a regular day basis out here? What you guys doing on a regular basis out here in Kensington, y'all? I chill out here. If I ain't trapping, I'm here. Huh? I, I, I just turn on the block. If I ain't trapping, I'm hitting. Okay. Oh, so you trap too? Yeah. Yes. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Do you sell the drugs you use? Yeah. Right. Yeah, if it's good. Yeah. All right. If it's good. But yeah, I'm damn near trapped on every block out here. Half the country owns me fucking bread. Yeah. No way. I ain't even throwing no smoke. What's one of the th craziest things y'all seen out here in Kensington? Oh, shit. Name one thing. Man, huh. Hold on, motherfuckers put a stick of dynamite in an ATM and mm. blew the fuck up. <laughs> oh, motherfuckers really? broke into, yes. Wow. Bro, bro broke into Winter Center, put a stick of dynamite under the safe and made the building catch on fire. Mm. And at the end when he turned the fire off, the only thing standing was a fucking safe in the back. Mm. Oh shit. I you guys far in the tracks? Oh that shit. Man, that's a lot, man. Y'all got enemies out here or Well, I know niggas or everybody street. Niggas hate but I don't it ain't like I don't owe no, no money. I can walk through these streets. Right. You know I mean? A lot of people dislike you? People just hate from the outside for no reason. Because I do what I do. I don't really gotta do shit. I can pop up in any set out here and motherfuckers throw me bread because they need that shit in their fucking veins. Yeah. I'm the best out here. You take pride in your work hit when it comes to hitting people? Huh, you are? Yeah, he's, he's the best for a reason. He actually cares about what the fuck he's doing. Oh, because if you miss them, that's when they can get wounds and stuff like that, right? Yeah, and if you're in the they start seizing out. You know what I mean? Yeah. Back in the day, if you hit somebody, you had to be sure what you were doing. Because yeah. if not, if you miss that shot, you owe that nigga that bread. Mm. 
Yeah, there's people out here that just say they know what they're doing and then they send people to the fucking hospital because they have no idea just for the money. Yeah. So I'm gonna ask both of y'all, right? How y'all got started with drugs? I used to bag up at the table, a hundred bundles every few hours, and you know, slowly but surely, <laughs> I stopped wearing the uh, hazmat suits and the mask, and it got in my system. Mm. And you know, one morning I wake up, and I'm throwing up. I call my cousin. He's like, "Yo, look at you, dope shit." Damn. He's like, "I'll be right there." He brought me a bundle of dope. He said, "Here, do a little bit of this." I was like, "No, no, no, no." <laughs> He's like, "Trust me, I did a little bit, and I was good." Was you upset with your cousin for doing that or what? He, 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 it was my choice. He left that shit on the table. I, I mean, I, yeah. that's it. He just brought oh, me So you went from just straight hustling to... Oh, I still hustle on You still hustle, but I'm just saying, at first it was just straight hustling, no use. No use, no, not at all. How about you, young lady? How um, yours started? My child's father was a highly functioning addict and hid it from me until a certain point. And I trusted him because I thought he would not do anything yeah. That would fuck me up. And uh, I was wrong. Yeah. That's that simple. Yeah. Do you guys feel safe out here in these treacherous streets? Yeah. Yep. I know I do. Once you solidified out here, <laughs> what okay. somebody could do. Okay, so you got the respect you deserve out this joint. Yeah, I mean, I got my roots in this bitch. Yeah. I can't Can go nowhere in this city without somebody calling me. Right. And I'm talking about not on the phone, I'm talking about they will run to me, cry to me, cry yeah. through shit for me. Just so I can stick to <laughs> Man. Do you demand your respect out, out here? Huh? If you disrespect it, do you demand your respect out here? Do I, baby? Oh my God, you should have seen what he did to the one dude that owed him 20 bucks. Mm. Just this morning. Yeah. He was uh, out here with a shot about to stick it in his fucking arm. Yeah. And he walked up to him and grabbed it and just sprayed it up into the sky. Oh, shoot. I will narc him, motherfuckers. Yeah. If you not off and you owe me money, I will narc him. Mm. And make you get the fuck up. Yeah. I will, oh my God. Could you date a softy? Or you gotta be a tough, you gotta be a tough one. Could you date a soft guy? I mean, he's both. So for his woman, but in the streets, he I'm gotta be tough. I, I appreciate I'm that. I respect I'm you for that. I'm humble as shit. Yeah. I'm humble as shit. Yeah. No, I don't bother nobody. Yeah. He I'm loves shit. me and takes care of me. Ozzy! I love you, freaking AJ. Yo, guys, I'm not gonna hold y'all up, man. Um, I'm happy y'all got each other's back. Y'all love each other. Y'all keeping each other safe. You know what I'm saying? Who y'all telling you? Would y'all tell the youth that's out here that's getting high, that's that's trapping, that's, you know what I mean, hitting people up? What advice would y'all give the kids? What advice would y'all give the kids, the little ones? Look, the difference now is this generation ain't got no old heads to lead them. Mm -hmm. I mean, when I was a young buck, I had old heads led me. I mean, they, they showed you what to do. They put you on with a pack. Mm -hmm. Then they gave you some work to bag up. You know what I mean? Then they introduce you to me, man. Yeah. You go from there, but these kids is these kids is reckless, man. Uh -huh. I don't know what to tell these kids. They don't they don't care. They don't they don't give a shit. They not thinking about their life later on in life. Yeah. You know what I mean? When you in that jail cell and then you got all them fucking minutes to think. I just got out. You just got out? Yep. Was the withdrawals bad? Oh my god. Was it? Was it? <laughs> I wanted to fucking hang myself. Mm. It's the worst thing ever. It's not worth it at all. You'll lose everything. You'll lose everything, and you'll lose it faster and faster every time you go through the process. Yeah. Well, well, guys, the curiosity ain't worth it. It's not cool. Don't do it. Guys, I would love to thank y'all for your time. I appreciate y'all having the courage to speak out. Everybody can't do this. My name is ATM Reed with All Time Media. I give a voice out to the voiceless. I'm praying for y'all, man. Yeah. Keep having each other back out here, man. Everybody don't got nobody, man. Fake friends, real enemies. Uh. Yep. <laughs> Join All Time Media's Patreon for exclusive content and behind-the-scenes content and face-to-face -face live video chat. Thank you, guys. The link is in the description below. For any business, promotion, or collaborations, our email is built fsmedia at gmail.com 
Like, comment, and subscribe. Thank you. All Time Media.